Welcome back to Icarus. My name is Nilaus and we are continuing this uh, showcase series of uh, this wonderful game. I'm having a blast with it. I have progressed a little bit more since uh, last time we were here, uh, here on YouTube. Now, first of a, a contextual uh, information that I'm playing this on Twitch and on YouTube. So what you see here on YouTube is uh, sort of a bit of summary and uh, some bits in between the stuff that I discover and do on uh, Twitch because this is, is this is a slow game, and that means... Uh, oh, that means I ran out of my... Uh, I have just one of those, but oh well. Um, it is a slow game, so because it is a slow game, that means uh, there's a lot of time it takes to level up and just farm and grind and that kind of thing. And I want to be uh, taking that away from these YouTube episodes and focus more on sort of the... Uh, the actual part. So look at this cozy place. We have a table. I got this from one of these missions. We can do these missions. I uh, don't really intend to do this. It's kind of mission right now. Uh, we have our very modest bedroll and a chimney here. We have uh, now got the cupboards. They are nice. We got over here a cooking station and a potbelly stove. That's very nice. We got the mortar and pestle. This is where we can primarily make epoxy. Um, crushed bone. Okay, well, I don't exactly have mammoth tooth tusk right now that's not really what i have interesting that that's the recipe that popped up and we have over here we can make antibiotic uh, toxin it's good if we should be bitten by a komodo uh, then that will be a little bit uh, inconvenient we can also get some flat bread some bread and bread gives extra xp gain so that's very nice we have over here we have our smelting array and our smithing here we have a, a bit of a textile bench the only thing we build here is a backpack because that's going to be handy just to carry more. But the main part of today will be about this construction here. Let's grab these things. Uh, we are going to be working on making a, a lot of a, a new build here. Because this one is collapsing every time there's a storm. Thank you for the accent here on the uh, situation of the issue with the storm. The storm is uh, coming in. And uh, I need to be a little bit worried about uh, whether that storm will also destroy... Um, the other part, let me just grab, ooh, that got us a little bit over where we want it to be, there, let, maybe if we drop some of this we'll go below again, are we, yeah, we're still 36.8, 0.8 seriously, seriously 0.8, there, that's t still that one, there we go, it's all good, we are gonna go out uh, despite the storm, oh, that's a bit nasty, so what I'm concerned about here, we are going to go up here to this location, I mentioned this in the previous episode, that I wanted to go up to uh, to this intersection of, if you look at it here, uh, right at the I-7, this one. I-7 sounds like a, a highway. It kind of is. Do you want to take this out? I don't know if that's dangerous. Let's see. No, it's not dangerous. Oh, we got a level up from that. That's very nice. Sweet. Uh, that's a very dead uh, buffalo in the water. Uh, we'll go grab it. Ooh, and we get machining bands. So we have a lot of interesting things to take a look at here as well. Uh, we'll uh, definitely get those. Oh yeah. That's a lot of chopping here. Jump up. So we have this one. If this collapses uh, in the storm, and that's kind of what I'm afraid of, then the stuff inside might break. So we are going to be uh, weathering the storm by just smashing on this one and trying to uh, to protect it from, from the storm. Protect ourselves as well. Maybe we could actually build. So what I've done is I have created a monstrous amount of uh, resources in here, so we don't have to be grinding uh, during during this episode. And what I've also been doing is putting these pillars in. They are spaced with two tiles apart. And as you can see here, we are building over here. We sort of build a mega structure, not a mega structure, but the, a big build on top of this that we. Uh, you will then build. Uh, I'm going to weather the storm and uh, just going to be standing here and make sure that this does not break during the worst part of the storm. So uh, I'll, uh, I'll see you when the weather clears up again. Alright, the storm has abated. A few trees have been knocked down, which is nice enough. So we don't have to take out our enemies. They take out, get taken out by themselves. Right, so we have uh, a building up here. Now this is going to be a glorious construction uh, we are going to make. And I will be starting to... I guess just two of these will be fine and then a whole stack of this. Okay, so the first thing I want to do is make sure that there's... There. Nine. We go up here and then get all of this up here. You can see the pattern here is that I have two by two 
and then I have pillars up there. So that is everything about this is uh, built on this. And I don't, I wouldn't call it a city block. Some would be, but it's not city block based. Uh, this part I'll rotate it, and then I'm gonna switch it to be here. And let me think. Yes, and yes. So we can now go up here, and then we can pave the whole thing. So we get sort of the contours of uh, the base that we want to have uh, later on. Let me just check if this is correct. If it points that way, then I, un from underneath I will have um, just kind of looking at these beams going the same way all over the place. That is very important. Cool. Now let's uh, just fill this in. So here's another, ah, another storm incoming. Why is the storm every time? All of them. It doesn't matter. Uh, what you can see here, we built a lot of this, but we still miss 40 more of these uh, plates, and then probably a little bit more than that. And uh, let's see if this is a big storm or if it's just a, a nice cozy little storm. So what I'm going to do is uh, I am going to show a new talent that I have acquired since last time. It is over here. It is Lucky Strike. Chance to mine a deposit in one hit. 1% 1 chance to just break it. And I will show you how easy it is to trigger this. Fingers crossed. There we go. It just triggered and we now have in our inventory. What? That was weird didn't actually get us that much. It's not as much. Usually it's like three, four hundred more. That was odd. Anyway, I need to go up here and protect my investment. And my investment being uh, my chest. Oh, baby deer. Okay. Oh, baby deer. Uh, this one is probably not. It's not uh, lost yet correctly. So we have to stand here and wait until the storm comes in and then sort of protect it again. Cutting it close here, we are really low head points, but it should be disappearing now, the, the storm, and not getting any more. Yeah, so the storm exposure is decreasing, and we should not be taking any more damage, please. There you go. No more damage to our environment, and we ended up at, well, it says 300, but I'm pretty sure I don't have 300 right now. Let's get the hell out of here and uh, not run into things and uh, let's just uh, go home and maybe just yeah let's just go home get some food sleep until morning it's all good uh, is that a wolf it might be really don't i have no idea what it is. this is a wolf it's a dead wolf cool that's that could just a single slash from a, <laughs> a wolf like this would have been killed killing me all right that's get a little bit more food get home and look at that beautiful home let's get back safely and heal rest sleep and oh wow this is also a little bit wrecked but uh, that's just the way it has to be here get food get that get that and get that we are now healthy again we can eat more of these uh, things here because they will give us plus 30 20 food okay let's just consume a stack doesn't work but every time I consume one, I get a little bit more hit points. So we can consume the stuff that is out there. There we go. All right. Uh, I will be getting things in here. And so we're coming up on the end of this level. There we go. This is going to be the framework for what we want. We can make something where we go down and get some water down there. But that's not the intention right now. What we uh, need to do is, well, first of all, take this one back again. And then I want to get a few of these for ramps and then start looking at... I kind of want to illustrate it with these first. And then we get over it. Doesn't matter. We'll, uh, we'll get all of this done eventually. Alright, so let's see. What is it I want to do? I want to show that I can build these things here. That's going to be one, two, and number three. That is going to be down here. And that is a... Looks like a staircase. Great. We'll get a staircase on the... Oh, no. We'll actually show here. So what I want to do is I want to have a building that is 3 by 3 here. And then I want out here to be able to run outside and just have a, a, a terrace all the way around. And then uh, if we look at this section here, this is 6 tiles long. And then in the corner over here, we'll have the same pattern. 
I'll be over on this side and we'll go to here and then we'll go to here. Then we'll make sure that we have the ramps down. Deploy ramps down here. That will be... Do we need it? No, it looks good. And the ramp over on this side is probably not going to make a lot of sense. No, it'll be right in the middle of nowhere. Cool. So let's not do that. Oh, hello bird. And we'll go over on this side. We're still overburdened by this. We, now we don't need these to be here now, but it'll give us sort of a, or at least give you an idea about what it is I want to build. Oh, and there we go. Finally no longer overburdened, and I can do a... Oh, we already did it here. Cool. What about here? We already did it. Sweet. And what does it have here? Yeah, so at this point I've kind of made it a little bit further out, because uh, if I just drop down here, then we're gonna yeah, fall in, in the water. That's less than ideal. Yeah. Here, here, and here. So now I need to figure out what it actually is I want to do or how I want to build it. Because one of the things that I've, I've sort of reflected on is that there is a piece missing. There is a... Mm, let's do... We can't do the roof yet. There. Let's get these parts. Oh, we're still overburdened. Doesn't matter. Alright, that's it. So we'll come up here and that means the first thing we want is in, in each of these corners will be a door. First of all, point it towards us and then figure out we want a door. There. We'll also want a door here. And then what do we want in the next two sections? Well, we can get just a normal basic window and a basic window. A flip it outside and a basic window. And then what do we want at this point? Now, I'd want to have like a big open building uh, here. So, I'm kind of leaning. We have a few options. All right, uh, let's see. I want this thing. And then, I want that. Yeah. Now, I'm kind of missing the one in the middle, unfortunately. But this is probably going to be fine. Because that kind of limit looks like things can be built here. And if I'm building it at this location, nope, uh, but okay. and I'll build the other part. There. So this will be sort of the house-ish. And we'll come in here, and then there'll be something here, and then you can walk down here, and there'll be crafting stations, and crafting stations, storage stations, whatever we want to come up with. We haven't really figured it out yet. Uh, but what I also want is... Here I want these these windows and they're gonna be here and they're gonna be here. I will also have them on the other side. And then get the matching part. Ah, we ran out. Oh we have a few more. That's this one. And, yeah, then this starts next corner section, I guess. Let's make that as well. Um, let's see, this will be a... Oh, here we also need a flat one. So we need a window and a window. And a window upwards and a window upwards. Great. And then we need... I want to right-click to change the shape, but that's not how it is in this game. Outbound and... And then the walls. Oh, and we don't have any more. Oh, well. All right, this gives us a little bit of an indication of what I'd uh, like to do. Then if we look at our options for roofs, then things become a little more limited, to be honest. Because I feel that we're missing something. Deploy. Uh, first of all, we need a roof. See, those are the only tiles. Do we want uh, this one? Flip it here and here. Then we need the corner piece. Yes. That can go here and that can go here. And then this will be an inverted corner. So that means we definitely need to buy some more things. Luckily we have seven points. And although we'd want to get the machine shop, I think we have to invest in the stuff that gets us right now. 
Uh, this is, oh, we have a stone roof corner. We don't know how many versions of it, it we have. Stone half pitches. Don't know what that does. Reinforced windows. Absolutely, we want that. Oh, look, reinforced railings. I like that. that the, that's expensive to get all the way around. But hey, it, don't care about the expenses. Spare no expense. We'll get that. We'll get that eventually. But we do have the roof corner things. So I think I need to go back and get some, build some more roof corners and then come back and see if we can uh, apply them in some context here. Wow. One hit and it exploded. That was pretty cool. And just for context, that is because I also have the Peerless hum Lumberjack. 1% chance to instantly fell trees. Not as good as the other one. Um, but we also have the Season Lockman. That means everything we chop gets added to our inventory immediately. So we'll continue chopping. Just uh, casually here. And then you can see as soon as we chop them here. Really, it disappears. Yeah, disappear because it goes directly into the inventory. It makes it a lot faster to do that. Uh, the one percent is not really worth it, but this is absolutely worth it. So we have returned to our construction site, and this time we brought more materials. So let's give that a shot and see how they uh, perform here. We have these materials now. Uh, they will be built here, and then this will be built as. Whew, I have no idea which one it is. That one. Yes, perfect. Now, that begs another question. Here. Like, how are we going to make it from this side? Like, obviously, I'd like it to make it... Um, nope, that's definitely correct. I would like this to be the other way, though. Like this, for example. Uh, yeah, that's a little bit tricky, how that's supposed to be flipped. Like that. And this one. Yes, except that's the problem now. How are we going to... Maybe on this side we actually need to go a little bit more up. Yeah. Let's try that. Let's try it. And that means we need to get a little bit more of the walls i guess let's get a few walls in here just a few we're so overburdened anyway that it doesn't really matter what we do it's just going to be way overburdened yeah and then what if we built these on top come on we can do it like that and like that yes and then we built this that we have looked at before. That one maybe. And yeah. Then they will hit the right place up the top. And then oh, uh, we go. Uh, yeah, we don't have the normal. <laughs> okay. And we, we try, we try. Yeah. And. All this is just testing and trying and stuff uh, to see what works. This part will be... And then you'll be... Oh, we also have the un inverse, I think. Is this the one? Let's be that one. Yes. And on this side will be the opposite. So it'll be here. And you'll get... And and that might be a little bit fragile. There we go. Now that little thing up there, that little border here is driving me crazy. And uh, let's see. Oh, really? Food is being delivered delivered to us. And let's get what is it we want? We want a little bit more of the roof tiles. A little bit more, as we say, a little bit, just 19 more roof tiles running around here with 371 kilos it's all good and whether do we want like a we want to even think of the idea that it could be uh, a, an extra like place up here I mean maybe maybe that would be pretty cool to have that I guess huh 
that would kind of make this one be a bit different. Okay, we're, we're just we're just brainstorming here. That would be first of all turn the other way around and then make it into a door, for example. And then this goes up on a door as well. Then it. <laughs> I don't know how this is gonna work. And we need some floors as well. I don't think we brought any floors. We have a little bit of that. I don't know if that's even gonna be valuable. That'll be deployed in here. And then, you know, I'm thinking that we maybe That will be here. Rotate like that, and then you can be taken out. And in favor of that, we build a normal wall here. Just a good old-fashioned wall. Yeah, a normal wall. Like that. And then we'll get the this one. Oh yeah. That's that's very interesting, I think. If we want to be really interesting, we'd also bring a pillar here. Now, how the hell do we get up there? <laughs> uh, I think we... I guess we could do stuff like this. But that would kind of intersect. So, I think the answer to that question is... We'll have to get a more of a reinforced ladder thing. Which we don't have yet, but we could get it. Okay, so that's yet another thing. I like that. I like I like the idea of this. Uh, and it gives us more space here, more space here. And yeah. All right, let's see how that would work on one of these paths. Now, if I also got... Uh, let's go back to inventory. If I got these up here... I, I like that idea. Except, <clears throat> would that then be open to the outside? I mean, that would be pretty cool to have it. I don't know why. I'd, nah, just make it windows or something. Uh, there, I guess. Yeah. But getting up there is definitely going to be one of our main concerns. And then we build up. Yeah. Let's make sure that it's the right one. That one. That one. No uh, windows in these tiles. I'm not really complaining about. Uh, yeah, that's also going. Okay. They're kind of complaining a little bit. They're orange. They're not red, but they are yellowish orange. And then we need to get up there to build that side. And I think I want the same kind of windows as we have down here, so we get as much light in as possible, and we can stand out, stand in here, and snipe. I don't want window. Or I don't want exits anywhere else than in the corners. That just fits better, I think. And then we want doors, and we want like there's a million things we want with this, and we won't be able to get all the way, but we can get a little bit of the way. Uh, this is going to be a normal wall that will be facing towards us, and then we'll get a. Yes, and let's see, then I want, it's like every single different kind of wall we want here. There's towards us for this, and, oh, we, oh, we ran out of those. Too bad. Like, there's, I, I built so much of this, and I was like, I am sure that I built way too many, way too much. It would be so annoying if I built too much. And yet, we are not even, we're not even anywhere, and we are woefully out of resources already there and that will just be a solid wall and let's see what else we have what do we have we have a few of these so we could build there there and there but not further than that okay there's a lot of stuff missing we are slowly approaching again our uh, ruin of a building or well, a little bit of a building. I don't like the fact that when we approach from below ground, we can see up under it. That is not the most sort of charming perspective of it. So we'll uh, keep that in mind. Uh, what I have done is I have also just 
gotten a little few of these things here that are just purely for aesthetic. It's just sort of kind of so we can get a sense of what it will look like if and when it'll ever be done. I have a little bit of, a, of an issue here. And ooh, that looks good. Uh, that is the fact that um, I am completely and utterly out of iron here. So that's really bad considering we are also just hitting level 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 20 so we can get the machining shop which takes 40 iron and 120 nails so that's a lot of iron and then everything afterwards comes in and just requires more iron more everything electronics uh, basic light there is definitely light oh this one needs electricity right yeah at least electricity so that's going to be an interesting thing we have so many things that we want to do but uh, that is not going to happen anytime soon uh, but that's uh, that's just for upcoming episodes. So just to uh, to sort of uh, reiterate on some of the things here, then uh, I am not going to complete this build today. Obviously, I think everyone can see that it's a little bit of an ambitious project here. And also, since I'm running out of iron, we are pretty screwed. Uh, but uh, I would encourage you to come and check out my next live stream uh, if you're watching this just as the video comes online. Then that's going to be on Sunday, and at the point we can. Uh, uh, that will at that point we will be working continue working on this also start getting more uh, stuff in here as well not just oh, i wonder if these are actually working uh, not just sort of building the framework but also moving stuff in and actually start using it uh, this looks so good let's see i also built a ladder i brought a ladder along so we need to figure out how that's going to be attached to something and um, that maybe press to interact okay that was interesting uh there oh right it was all right and then up here we are needing some oh wall segments i did not build any wall segments did i no i didn't i i built some things but not everything and we have a we have more things to do more things to to do here for sure that one gets over here and this location this needs to be boxed in and here what else do we have we have a brought a lot of these uh yeah and that one right so i kind of want something up here instead of just making windows i don't exactly know what if you have ideas come join me on twitch and we can uh, we can figure out what to do here, but I think there's an interesting potential by having by having uh, an upstairs here as well. It's not going to be big upstairs, and it might not be used for anything, but it's there, and I think it just makes it a little bit more interesting uh, as we look at it. Right, and let's see. So we we're we're pretty good in this. I think it will just make a little more things, and then we'll be uh, taking a look at it from the outside. Right, I think this is a pretty damn nice uh, build we got here. Maybe we can do something. Well, of course we can do some more. I think that the lines we have here, these lines, they help a lot on sort of uh, break up the monotony. And also remember, this is uh, not even half of it we've done. It also looks interesting on the inside. I want to do something where we can go down and just tap some water at the, at the water surface from the inside. Um, and I don't know what else. We'll figure out what else that needs to be done. But we certainly have a lot more work to do here. Mainly in terms of getting more iron, so that means going into mining, going, um, yeah, going to go out exploring, which is something that fits just a lot better on a Twitch stream than on a YouTube episode. So I hope you enjoyed it as we get the rain coming in. Good thing we have a nice st sturdy stone structure to uh, hide in when, uh, as the rain and storm comes, uh, comes roaring in. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. As uh, as always, be sure to hit the like button if you do that. Um, then uh, I very much appreciate that. It shows me uh, that you have an interest in this game. Uh, I'm uh, having a blast with this uh, game. So uh, that's it. Uh, goodbye. Um, yeah, I'm having a blast with this game and I'm certainly con going to continue. I want to get sort of explore everything there is to explore, like all of the stuff that is here. And then maybe we'll uh, even go out and we get a little bit more mature uh, on this or maybe a higher level we can composite uh, chest armor. Ooh. We can uh, do some of those missions as well, but certainly we just want to have a nice, strong, sturdy base here that we can uh, explore from. Thank you for watching. Until next time, take care, and as always, stay effective.